As you gaze at the starry sky, your eyes may lock onto the twinkling lights that dance above the horizon. Each glowing star seems to whisper a silent question into the vastness of space. That question, are we alone, has echoed in the minds of people across civilizations. This timeless curiosity has stirred the hearts of scientists and dreamers watching the dark heavens. For centuries we've looked into the cosmos, searching for signs that might hint at life beyond Earth. That deep desire to understand our place in the universe continues to inspire skyward wonder. A groundbreaking device now orbits high above the planet, built to help us answer that ancient mystery. The James Webb Space Telescope JWST, is this marvelous creation floating silently in space. It's more than a telescope, it's a revolutionary tool magnifying the secrets of distant worlds. The JWST captures details previously hidden from view in the infinite void. Among its many finds, one discovery has stirred deep excitement across scientific communities. The telescope began examining an exoplanet known as potassium boride, glowing in its faraway system. This planet is no ordinary sphere floating in orbit, it holds many fascinating and complex traits. One of the most stunning discoveries is the presence of water vapor in the planet's atmosphere. Water, the cornerstone of life on Earth, now exists far away in this distant sky. Its detection suggests that potassium boride could have the potential to support life in its alien landscape. Even more surprising, scientists identified a molecule commonly tied to biological life on our world. This molecule may be a biomarker, suggesting the presence of living organisms under that hazy cloud. Could this be the evidence we've long dreamed of, hiding in plain sight within deep space? The possibility has driven researchers to look closer at this planetary body through the telescope's lens. K218b lies 120 light years away, glowing quietly in its stellar neighborhood. It is categorized as a sub-Neptune, a class of planet with no direct match in our solar system. That makes potassium boride an intriguing object, with mysteries shrouded in its swirling clouds. Its physical structure lies between Earth and Neptune, making it a unique shape in the cosmic scene. Planets like Earth and Mars help frame our understanding of the galaxy, but this one breaks that mold. K218b may orbit a small red star known as K218, a faint sun in the endless blackness. Its location falls within the habitable zone, meaning liquid water could pool on its unseen surface. Despite its closer orbit compared to Earth, this red dwarf emits far less heat into the surrounding void. A full year on K218b lasts only 13 days, a rapid cycle around its faint sun. Yet, that proximity doesn't fry the planet thanks to the star's lower luminosity filtering through its atmosphere. This delicate balance has allowed the JWST to detect vaporized water floating high in the planet's sky. This detection builds a stronger case that potassium boride might be more than just a dead rock in space. Alongside water, researchers identified methane, a gas that vanishes quickly under starlight. Another compound spotted was dimethyl sulfide, DMS, found only through biological processes on Earth. DMS is made by microbes in our oceans, and its presence suggests possible life in distant seas. Such a finding is not just unusual, it could be historic in the story of the observable universe. Life on a planet orbiting a red dwarf, usually hostile, would change the narrative of existence in the cosmos. To sustain liquid water, a planet must sit in a thermal balance within its local system. If K218b maintains a stable hydrogen-rich atmosphere, its conditions might mirror Earth's temperatures. This dense atmosphere could hold in heat, keeping potential oceans from evaporating into the cold sky. Such surface water would be a powerful clue that the planet may harbor something like life in its depths. Astrophysicist Nick Mattis proposed a new label for planets like K218b in his groundbreaking study. He called them HEIC worlds, hydrogen-rich exoplanets in the cloud. These planets may weigh up to 10 times as much as Earth yet remain covered by thick oceanic layers. Instead of blazing deserts, these planets could hide vast seas under their protective skies. 
A hydrogen envelope could allow water to remain stable across different orbits from their parent star. Such conditions would be unlike anything on rocky planets like Earth, Mars, or even the frozen moons. If microbial life exists there, HEIC worlds like K218b may offer the first true glimpse of alien existence. They're not just rare, they may be common across the wide galactic spread. Even with powerful tools like the JWST, studying these distant planets remains a huge challenge. To peer deeper, astronomers observed potassium boride during a transit, when it crossed its star's face. As light passed through the planet's atmosphere, it left a signature in the starlight. This light, broken down into different wavelengths, carried a fingerprint of chemical markers. If some wavelengths were missing, it indicated that specific elements had absorbed the light. That method allowed scientists to reveal the true makeup of the planet's distant atmosphere. This technique has become essential in building a realistic profile of exoplanets beyond our solar reach. The JUST's ability to separate light this way reflects a huge leap in technological power. By examining this spectrum, scientists uncovered molecular traces in the planet's airy environment. This moment represents a turning point in our search for life, deep in the mysterious cosmos. Water, DMS, methane, and carbon dioxide all whisper tales from this unseen world. The possibility of life here pushes us to reconsider how wide the web of existence truly stretches. With every new glimpse into the stars, we edge closer to answering that ancient question in the night. Subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.